ex deputy ipop leader uche mefo deletes facebook page and disappears the former deputy leader of ipop uche mefo has suddenly deleted his facebook page and disappeared the estranged deputy leader uche mefo who became very outspoken had called for a change of approach and attitude among the members of the movement, but his appeals were met with verbal assaults from members of his group. There was an alleged feud between Mefo and Namdekano, which culminated to a very serious war of words between the duo. Sources who are very close to IPOP Dawes said that Kano, who could not condone the overbearing nature of Uchimefu secretly dismissed him from the hierarchy of the organization. His removal was done clandestinely to avoid raising unnecessary eyebrows, which could further whittle the sense patronage currently enjoyed by the crooks in charge of the outlawed organization, as reported by Elomba News. There were claims that Uche Mefo took his Facebook page down because of security reasons. Another reliable early of Mefo allegedly said that Namdekano crossed the red line after he disgraced their former African representative, George Onyibe, who was a strong hitman of IPOP out of office. What we before Namdekano and IPOP in no distant time will be shocking. Any ear that hears it will tingle, the early said. Namdekano, who is running a salary driven freedom fighting movement, has been accused of being autocratic, arrogant, and fraudulent by some of his former elites. Thank you for listening to this news. It is a blackmail. Yes, it is a blackmail. Let me tell you something, my viewers. Uche Mefo, yes, of a truth, he deleted his Facebook page. But then I will tell you that there was a misunderstanding between him and Namdekano of a truth. But that misunderstanding has been resolved. Uche Mefo left willingly. He left willingly. And he never left with grudges. He never left with grudges. So people are only saying that because they know Uche Mefo to be an, a very active member of the IPOP. Look at it now. The deputy leader of IPOP. So definitely, as he left willingly, a lot of reactions. There will be a lot of reactions. A lot of people will come up with fake news concerning the deputy leader. Just like they have just come up that he, he, he left due to the arrogancy observed by Namdekan, which is not true. Do you understand? Which is not true. But there is something I would like to leave behind for IPOP in general. Please and please and please, IPOP, your uh, um, the world are watching you and mm -hmm. you know the enemies of Biafran are so much and this is what they have been praying to see that happens to IPOP this is what they have been praying and agitating for that there should be misunderstanding between you so that you people will be distracted of where you are heading to okay look at uche mefo now do you know that in his mind now what is going on in his mind is no longer the behalf of naturalization but a different thing entirely when you decide to search his mind meaning that he has been distracted and one of the slogan of ipop is never be distracted never you allow yourself to be distracted but now that he has left willingly it means that he has been distracted purely 
He has been purely distracted. And there is no doubt about that. You get it? So what Namdi Kano should try and do is, as a leader, he should try all his possible best to bring his people back together. Back together. He should make them see the reason why there is need for them to come together again. Again. He should allow them to witness that unity once again. Both the ones that left willingly and the ones that never left willingly, he should do all his best to bring them back together again. So that they will know, the world will know that IPOP still remains as one family. Because that is what they have been eyeing. That is what they have been praying and agitating for. You understand? So let us not give them that impression. Let us not give them that opportunity to talk. Because that is what they are actually looking at. You understand? That's what they are actually looking at. So, uh, my viewers, I use this medium to speak to my fellow peer friends. Okay? Not to be distracted by whatever news gotten concerning Jemefo. Not to be distracted at all. Everything is still very much in order. Biafran hasn't experienced any division. Biafran never experienced any separation. Biafran is still very much united as ever before. Uche Mifu is still a strong believing member of IPOP. You understand? It's just some little misunderstanding that made him to go a little bit far. But I assure you, my viewers, that everything will be resolved. You understand? So as for my IPOPs, please and please and please, let us try to maintain decorum, maintain unity, maintain peace, and bring ourselves back together. You understand? So by so doing, it will go a long way in helping cop out so many um, issues. You understand? So, um, my viewers, I want to beg us to please come into this matter. Leave your own comment below the comment box. Click on the subscription button as well as bell buttons to get updated whenever we upload any new videos. Thank you.